Hello YouTube, this is Mr. Angelo Ryan, and this is the second episode of my uh, slime farm. And yes, this is another overvoice, uh, as are all of the slime farm episodes going to be. Because I actually just checked up on the stuff that I had filmed at the end, where I thought it was recording my voice, and it wasn't because I didn't stop fraps and reopen it and everything. So, I'm sorry about that. And also, if this audio sounds horrible like the first episode, I'm also sorry about that. I have no idea why, but the audio sounds good when I record it into Fraps, but when I record it into my uh, editing system, which is PowerDirector Pro 9, not really much good comes from it. It sounds really bad, and uh, <coughs> it's it's horrible, but... This was uh, too good a footage to pass up. Uh, maybe the last episode of this slime farm thing will be an actual voice because uh, I didn't record the last bits of me making it. But I do want to I do want to show you guys the finished product because the very last episode recording I did that one day I didn't get to use. I I didn't uh, I I. Sh I just can't talk. Okay, let me start over. The last uh, recording that I did in there, I didn't finish the slime farm because I had to do dishes. My sister told me that I had half an hour left to do dishes, and apparently I had like an hour left. But either way, I didn't have time to finish it, so I went and did dishes. And later that night, I went back and finished the farm. But it was a little too late to be recording because people were sleeping because I'm up way too late I probably should start getting back into sleeping regularly because I got winter break ending pretty soon uh, the ninth actually it's gonna end and I gotta go back to school that'll, that'll be a pain but I mean I kinda miss school if, if you guys are in school you should understand like you miss seeing your friends and stuff you don't miss actually going to school but you miss seeing your friends at the school if that makes sense to you at all so, uh, right now I'm working on destroying the ceiling. Uh, the really boring parts are gonna be gone fairly soon since I got my team working in here. And by team, I mean I said, who wants to work? And people said, sure, why not, because I'm a builder. So they respect my authority. If you guys want to have fun reading the chat, you can do that. I'm not reading it. I had no idea what was going on, because I was talking to you guys. So, that's that. Anyways, uh, I wanted to share with you guys uh, something funny I saw last night. Everyone where I live is flipping out about this video on YouTube. It's been up for like a year, but it just recently became viral. And it's these white girls, uh, like, talking about how Mexicans shouldn't be in America because they're, like, illegal. And they should just go back to Mexico. And they were they were saying really racist things. It wasn't just like their opinion. They were just completely blasting Mexicans in general. And so people were flipping out about their racism. And uh, later that night, I was looking on Facebook again. Because before that video was posted, like all morning long. And then there was another video I saw that uh, be was uploaded January the 5th and it already gone viral. I'm pretty sure it's nearing 100,000 plus views. And it's this Mexican girl come back to talk shit about the white girls. And uh it goes horribly wrong. Like she gets done with her whole ranting on how like the white girls have no ass and how they're being racist. And then she's like wish you the worst, hope you get shot and then this picture falls and hits her in the head and j she just has a look of pain in her eyes and then she reaches over and shuts off the camera and uh, I found that pretty hilarious I mean I find no no humor in drama at all nothing good can come of it but uh, that video was hilarious and she she blasts them uh, she puts the numbers up there too I didn't call them because I don't care but uh, I wonder if it's actually their numbers God, I'm only five minutes into the recording. I don't have much to say. Oh. Yeah, I was talking to someone. Uh, they were making me stone bricks. But they were taking a little too long. 
So I made my own. Oh, oh wait, no. That was me telling him I needed stone bricks. Later on, I make my own stone bricks because he wasn't doing it fast enough. Oh, this way you get to see the uh, the elevator that I did. Uh, I actually did a test on this. I got the idea from Ethos. I mean, I'd seen it before, but I got the idea to use it as a ladder from Ethos. Like a ladder for yourself. And uh, I did test it. I don't know if he tested it. He said he was going to. But I tested it myself, and it is just as fast as climbing a ladder. It just kind of looks a little better, in my opinion. And then that's my safe drop over there. So I came up here to get charcoal, as you probably saw in the chat if you've been reading it. Uh, because I wanted to cook some stone brick, finish up the walls, and this is my pretty tree farm. Uh, there I go, using my slash home. You get to see my basement again. I'm in here quite a bit, because I come here to get materials. That's where I have all my stuff. So, um, new story, also, but this one's actually Minecraft related. Uh, just f like 10 minutes ago, like right before I started recording this, I, uh, I was on my single player world, and I, th I just finished watching Ant Venom's, uh, Hunt for the Ender Dragon, episode 6. And I saw that he was looking for a stronghold, and that, that inspired me. That made me want to go look for a stronghold. And I was like, hmm, but I'm like so far away. And then I thought, wait, my single player map, I've already found the nether stronghold. So, that means that I had blaze powder. I had quite a bit of blaze powder. I had like 20 blaze rods or something like that. Uh, the problem was I didn't have any ender pearls, so I killed... I was able to kill two endermen and I only got one pearl out of it but uh, that was good enough for me I got the one pearl and that lasted me the entire way finding the stronghold strongholds like 800 blocks from my house that's like it I was like wow that's great only like 800 blocks from my stronghold so I'll probably set up a cart system there oh by the way the single player map isn't the one that you guys that you guys have seen as far as recording goes because I haven't recorded anything on there. It's just my for fun single player map. But if you guys are interested in seeing any recordings on there, go ahead and let me know in the comment section. Uh, and maybe I'll start recording some stuff on there. I'm not on there a lot. Not really at all. But I just found the stronghold, so I want to unlock that. Oh, by the way, guys, that's not Herobrine. That's uh, someone's skin. I think it's NB Mano. That's the Herobrine skin whatever uh hmm I feel like I had more to say in that story oh I want to get the uh, ender eyes activate the portal and visit the end but uh, it's crazy I found a I found a stronghold but you know what I've yet to find on my single player map or on any single player map to be exact um a what what are they called abandoned mine shaft I have not found a single abandoned mine shaft except on multiplayer so I have no melons I mean not that melons are super important except for potions that's what I'd use my melons for is the potions because uh, as far as food goes you could just make a big wheat farm and bread heals to like 2.25 times as much as melons do I don't know it's somewhere around 2 I tried to do the math in my head just now and it didn't quite work Oh uh, yeah, I asked people for materials. Alright, that was NB Mano. I thought so. Uh, I really don't like these over voices, but I really do like the slime farm footage, even though lots of it's just random stuff. Oh, this is where I told you... Uh, is this? No, I was gonna say... I thought this is where I tell you I'll uh, be back later, but it's not. Because uh, at some point I tell you, I'm just going to, oh, it's when I cook the stone brick. I'm, I just tell you, I'm going to let this stone brick go ahead and cook up for a while. And I'll come back to you guys when that's done, since I'm mostly going to be standing here. Which was true, I was uh, just standing there. And I'm staring at my memory card right now, and there's a lock slider thing on it. I've had this memory card forever, and I don't even know what that does. Shouldn't mess with it. Break stuff. So, I've tested the slime farm, 
and it doesn't seem to have a huge spawning rate. Uh, but they do spawn, and I've gotten probably a stack of slime balls from it. But question for you guys: uh, Is it the grass? Do you guys know anything about slime spawning? Could it be the grass? It's well lit. Uh, no torches anywhere. All the lighting is jack o' lanterns on the ground, and it's it's not particularly spawning too well. Oh, I I discovered charcoal in there that I didn't even know I had. So it turns out that I didn't really have to make charcoal, but I did anyways because, you know, it always comes down to I have to go kill a bunch of trees and make charcoal because I don't have any charcoal or coal and I don't go caving enough. I'll probably cave more when I get a silk touch pick or, and or a fortune pick. I really want both. Like, I'd cave with my silk touch, I'd keep, I'd keep my fortune at home. And then I just bring back the blocks and then place them and break them with a fortune pick. That's probably one of my goals on here. Uh, last night I worked on a mob trap. Uh, I already had one, but it sucked because I had no idea about anything about mob traps. The spawning pads were massive, and uh, they had to walk quite a ways to drop down. No water pushed them. Spiders clogged it up. It was terrible. But, uh, I looked up spawning basics for mobs, and I got it all fixed. And so, I don't know how efficient it is, because I haven't been on the server, really. I've just been messing around on YouTube, etc. So, I'm going to cook my stone now, and then uh, the video's going to cut to when I have it all finished. And, uh, yawn. Uh, that was a long yawn. Did you guys know that yawns are contagious? Uh, Mythbusters have tested it, and they truly are contagious. It's not just uh, a myth. So, if you guys yawned after that, that means yawns can even be spread through the internet. They didn't test that. That, w that would be interesting. But I know that yawns can be sent person to person, because if you're in a big group, like with your friends, and one person yawns, Pretty soon everyone's yawning, whether they're tired or not. I used to know what the, the technical thing for a yawn is, but uh, I don't anymore. Uh, here we go, we cut back. So now, I don't know if you want to call this the interesting part, or the uh, different part. I'd say it's different. This entire thing isn't too particularly interesting, unless you like the stories I tell or the things I say, reading the chat. Because it's mostly just breaking blocks and placing blocks and me standing around when I was talking. I had some good content in there, but I can't really use it because it didn't record the voice. I don't know exactly what I said. So that's the bad part about not record about it recording, but it not recording is you can't recreate what you said. Because sometimes you can't. Sometimes you. Uh, comment on things that you've said in the in there and uh, I can't really comment on things I've said in here because I don't know what I said and I can't comment on things happening because that would just be me saying and then I placed stone brick and then I placed stone brick and then I broke some cobblestone and then I placed stone brick and so that would be very boring for you guys to hear for like half an hour or multiple episodes uh, but yeah, I think that I have like the only s working uh, farm on this server, as far as I've checked, because the other ones are super slow because they got torches on the ground. I've been trying to talk with people, fix up their places. I know that mine's the only one that's uh, decorated, otherwise I would have been done a long time ago with this slime farm, but I don't like ugly looking stuff. I like to make it have some extra bits of... Oh yeah, I was trying to get people to Skype call me. This is when I really started. And it turns out it didn't even record my voice when I was Skype calling. It recorded the other guy's voice, but not my voice. So, we won't particularly use that. Because that'd be him talking to himself. Uh, yeah, no. <sighs> uh, now you guys can see my Skype name. <clears throat> And like add me on Skype or whatever. 
I don't know. I don't really accept random requests, and I don't really Skype with people all that much. I Skype with people when I'm playing Minecraft with them occasionally, and sometimes I'll Skype with friends. But I'm not. A, I'm not a big Skyper. I know some people are, but I'm not. Let's see. What else do I have to say? I bought a T-shirt last night uh, from Take Flight. It's uh, I don't know what it is actually because it's their like some special they're having like a grab bag thing basically you just put in your size and you could and you, it's seven dollars but you don't know what t-shirt you'll get it's one of ten different t-shirts and you don't even know the ten different ones so i will be expecting that around the time i go back in school got quite a bit of new stuff i got my minecraft shirt that was nice i think i'm addicted to buying things online I just all the time gotta buy something else from an online website and I don't know if that's good or bad or normal but I do it I've been buying lots from Take Flight I bought from Jinx lot and when I say lots from Take Flight I mean lots I've gotten a pair of pants three pairs of shirts uh, and then I just uh, no I just got another pair of shirts I, another shirt too. Uh, did I say pairs of shirts? Three pairs of shirts. Shirts don't come in pairs. I got four shirts from Jinx. I might be getting something else. I don't know. I just like buying stuff online. There's a better selection, and I don't even have to leave the comfort of my computer chair until it shows up in the mail. And even then, I don't always have to leave the comfort of my computer chair because, uh,. Sometimes someone else will check the mail and they'll just bring me my clothes. And then I get to try them out. And it's nice. Here, like here, he gives me this stone brick. And I'm just like, hmm. No, you take some. And you play some. <laughs> and he's like, aw, sad face. Because I, I assumed that he was making that so that he'd play some. Since I already made... <sighs> since I already made 12 stacks. I'm really interested to see how this audio is going to come out. If it's if it comes out good, that's great. It was just some glitch with the mic or the system in the first episode, but if it comes out the same as the first episode, I really do apologize, guys. I'd normally refrain from uploading footage like this, but I really wanted to get like the one a day thing going on with this slime farm. And I do need you guys' ideas on what else I should do on the server. Please, please, please put them in the comments. Uh, because I will I will accept all ideas and, you know, at least give it a shot. Try to blueprint it out. And if I think, uh, if I think it's possible or something that I'd be interested in doing, I'll do it. I'll film it. It may be a fail. It may not. <laughs> we'll see. You guys will see when we, uh, I mean, when you get the footage. I would like to find a stronghold on the server, but I think all three stronghold uh, I think all three strongholds have been found. And I'm not one to go out and kill Endermen on SMP. Because Endermen are super glitchy. In single player, I can use that glitch. Well, I wouldn't really call it a glitch. Just call it uh using the game to my advantage. Oh, I lost the game. Yeah guys, I lost the game. Uh but I use it to my advantage, like where you attack their feet, don't look at their face at all, just attack their feet, and uh, they won't teleport anywhere. Uh, I forget where I figured that out from, but I know I figured it out somewhere, and uh, it's been very helpful. On single player, Endermen rarely kill me. What are you barking at, dog? My dog's barking because people are walking or whatever. I don't know if you guys heard that, but they barked. <laughs> Who didn't deop themselves? So I guess I can find out when I go back and read the chat if I feel like it. People are talking. One of one of our admins got banned, and apparently, uh, one of them uh, quit slash deoped themselves or whatever. Oh, I didn't gather that gold. Well, I guess it's not really necessary with the amount of gold that I have. And the fact that gold is useless, except for powered rails and golden apples. Golden apples, uh, doesn't matter. 
because the strongholds have been found, and uh, that means the apples have been taken. Oh, he needed stone brick. Ah, so this episode is coming to a close fairly soon. Uh, I hope you enjoyed my commentary and uh, my placing of stuff. <laughs> oh, this is back when Eagle was a builder. Eagle's an admin. I don't know if there's any video footage with him of an admin being an admin, I don't think so, because I recorded this all in like one, one and a half hours or something like that, but uh, yeah, it was quite the long recording session, I don't know if you guys know how hard it is to keep yourself talking and talking and talking for that long amount of time, uh, because it is, I have, I have problems keeping myself talking, because I don't really have much interesting to say, I kind of just blab on about things you guys maybe care about, most likely don't care about. Uh, I'm thinking about having a contest. Seems like I mention all the important things at the end of my videos. Maybe that's just like a way to see if you guys watch the whole video, I'll mention it towards the end. And if you guys watch the whole video, you get to hear about it. So, I, I'm thinking of holding a contest, uh, either for, like, I, could, I don't know, I'd, I'd appreciate fan art or something. Or, I, what I really, really have been wanting forever is an intro. I'm probably going to mention that in, like, every single video ever. I want an intro. I do. So please, just anything you can throw together as an intro, whether it's an all-purpose intro, a vlog intro, a Minecraft intro, a parkour intro, you know... I guess airsoft, but I don't really do airsoft, so just any of those other intros, uh, I'd appreciate. Right now, uh, I think I was checking Skype for something. Uh, probably accepting requests and sending out a Skype call, because I believe that I, yeah, this is where the Skype call started, so this is where I'm just like, oh, I forgot recording, that sucks. And I was all angry with myself. Uh, and then I just started talking. I was like, oh well, well, we'll solve this problem. We'll just plug in my mic and start talking. Didn't work. But oh well. So I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Uh, the next episode will be uploaded tomorrow. Uh, don't forget to comment, rate, like, and subscribe. Love you all. Bye.